Imagination is the wide open eye which leads us always to see truth more vividly. In tragedy every moment is eternity, in comedy eternity is a moment. Poetry is a language in which man explores his own amazement. The first of our senses which we should take care never to let rust through disuse is that sixth sense, the imagination. I mean the wide open eye which leads us to see truth more vividly, to apprehend more broadly, to concern ourselves more deeply, to be, all our life long, sensitive and awake to the powers and responsibilities given to us as human beings. There may always be another reality to make fiction of the truth we think we've arrived at. Between our birth and death we may touch understanding as a moth brushes a window with its wing. Life itself is the real and most miraculous miracle of all. If one had never before seen a human hand and were suddenly presented for the first time with this strange and wonderful thing, what a miracle, what a magnificently shocking and inexplicable and mysterious thing it would be. The best thing we can do is to make wherever we're lost in look as much like home as we can. I know your cause is lost, but in the heart slash of all right causes is a cause that cannot lose. One day I shall burst my bud of calm and blossom into hysteria. Comedy is an escape, not from truth but from despair, a narrow escape into faith. Life is a hypocrite if I can't live the way it moves me. We must each find our separate meaning in the persuasion of our days, until we meet in the meaning of the world. Who apart from ourselves can see any difference between our victories and our defeats? If we could wake each morning with no memory of living before we went to sleep, we might arrive at a faultless day. Poetry has the virtue of being able to say twice as much as prose in half the time, and the drawback, if you do not give it your full attention, of seeming to say half as much in twice the time. Poetry is the language in which man explores his own amazement, says heaven and earth in one word, speaks of himself and his predicament as though for the first time. What is madness to those who only observe is often wisdom to those to whom it happens. I travel light as light, that is, as a man can travel who will still carry his body around because of its sentimental value. Indulgences not fulfillment, is what the world permits us. The moon is nothing but a circumambulating aphrodisiac divinely subsidized to provoke the world into a rising birth rate. The lines marking a penalty area are a disgrace to the playing fields of a public school.